a lot of things have changed in Audi's inline five-cylinder motor since its introduction, horsepower, torque, displacement, materials, but one thing remains the same, its firing order Audi's beefed up, sometimes street sometimes race engine went from 350 horsepower in the Quadro A1 rally car, to 600 horsepower in the Sport Quattro S1, to 720. HP in the insane looking Audi 90 Quadro IMSA GTO It's been a long road to the 2018 TTRS and RS3 street cars. Audi's new aluminum block Hollow crank 2.5 liter turbocharged 5 is 57 pounds lighter than its road going predecessor and now makes 400 horsepower and 354 pounds FT of torque, which maxes out between 1,700 and 5,850 rpm. But the order 1, 2, 4, 5, 3 is the same as 37 years ago. The TTRS and RS3, both on sale now, are built on the same MQB platform have the same i5 and 7-speed S-Tronic dual-clutch transmission and have nearly the same interior but they're two very different cars. Okay, not that different, but between the two, they have most of the enthusiast market covered, including the young affluent family demo who might need more than the laughable rear seat in the TTRS, even if it does split and fold both models are differentiated from their lesser siblings with RS single frame grills, matte aluminum trim, except when it's black, the RS script, obviously, and the oval tailpipes the A3 has two round tips, the S3 has quad tips. Only the RS models get the ovals and only these two get the mixed up, growling sound of a true inline 5. If you've never heard an inline 5 driven in anger, well, first take a second and watch this, we'll wait in the TTRS and RS3, it sounds like a whooshy, raspy, angry swarm of hornets, but also a little bit like a tweaked up 4 with a plastic cold air intake both get launch control, good for 0 to 60 times of 3.6 and 3.9 seconds for the TTRS and RS3, respectively. Top speed is 174 miles per hour for both, as long as you specify the Dynamic Plus package, $6,000 TTRS, $4,800 RS3, which comes with front ceramic brakes, OLED taillights on the TTRS, carbon fiber engine cover and a fixed sport suspension instead of a magnetic adjustable setup. The cockpits are similar, but not identical. The TTRS has Audi's virtual cockpit which puts all the infotainment in the gauge cluster. The RS3 has a pop-out central screen, 